We started our collection in 1950 when we were first married. We've been married now 73 years. This is not the entire collection. Yes, on occasion we see one we just can't resist. <laughs> There's just something about them that draws us to them. She had a friend that told her if you had three of something, you had a collection. And so anytime she had three of something, she could feel free to go ahead and start adding to it. They say great minds think alike. And in the small town of Columbus, three separate families have all had one mind about a Christmas compulsion. For decades, they never knew each other. But now, all of their efforts have been combined into one massive collection. And the Columbus Chamber of Commerce says, once you visit their newly expanded museum, their citizen's holiday hobby will get its claws into you. We're in the Santa Claus Museum. We are the only one in the South, and it's a wonderful one-of-a-kind museum. It's roughly three collections here, and we're almost at 4,000 pieces. You heard that right. Nearly 4,000 jolly old Saint knickknacks fill a cute little house with Christmas joy. It's a combination of three private family collections. The Lumens and the Hubenex are the most recent additions. But it all started with the great-grandmother of Santa Claus collecting in Columbus, Mary Elizabeth Hopkins. Thanks to this museum, her daughter, Mary Ann, can share family memories with the town and with Mary Elizabeth's descendants. It's the first time the three of us have been here together uh, in a long, maybe ever. We have eight grandchildren in all, and they all have been here at one time or another. This one was her first one that they, her parents bought when she was a baby, and uh, it was on our Christmas tree every year all my life. And this one is the, the department store Santa that really jump-started the, uh, the whole collection because she thought he was so unique because he had uh, a green eye and a red eye, and that appealed to her, and she um, immediately snatched him up, and from that, well, then she just went crazy buying <laughs> Santa Clauses. Since 1990, the Santa Claus Museum has welcomed tourists, kids, and kids at heart. And the truly obsessed, like fellow Claus collector, Meryl Lumen, say there's just something magical about sharing a Christmas connection. It's very dear to us very dear to us and we're so glad that uh, they're sharing the museum and taking our collection here to go with the other collection that's already here. Connection of love because everybody loves Santa Claus and we're glad to share that joy with other people. He brings joy to everybody, whether it's little or big. You know, everybody just, their eyes light up when they see the museum. Um, it's, of course, a lot to look at, at almost 4,000 pieces. Um, and if you have a love for Santa, you will love the museum. I really do believe in Santa. I think good things happen to good people. Good morning, Santa. I think he, he does represent love and, and giving, the importance of giving to others. And I'm very proud of this museum. I'm so proud of what they have done here. Uh, and have, I think it's, it, it's, good. it's good for us. It's good for Columbus. It's, I hope that a lot of people come and enjoy it because it is such a, a wonderful place. Yeah.